to my channel, you're probably just like, who is this girl? I didn't even know I subscribed to you. Yeah, I know. It's been like forever since I made a new video. But let me make this up to you guys with this video and many more on a regular basis. Now that I'm situated and everything, my shit's kind of together. I will have time to make more videos for you guys at least once a week. So, um, like for example, today I'm gonna record two videos. Mm -hmm. Two at the same damn time, yup. <laughs> Just cause like, it's a great day and my makeup actually looks really good. <laughs> and I did a bunch of shopping, got it finally. So yeah, let's get started. I didn't even tell you guys what this video is gonna be about. Like, this is my Cyber Monday Black Friday haul. So excited because I have not went in this in in like months. Okay, like I usually buy like one or two things here and there because the bitch broke. So I buy one or two things here and there. But the Cyber Monday deals and the Black Friday deals, I'm like, hold up. Mm -mm, let's call my name. This is for me. I got to get this, that, 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 that. Everything on my wish list. These lashes. Okay. Like, they're just so pretty. And I saw a bunch of pictures of them on Instagram. So, you know, I had to get me some Lily lashes. And there they are. So cute. OMG, dude. But do you see that? It looks so realistic, so awesome. So yeah, that's the back of it. The name is Mino Mikonos. But I'm gonna put it in the description box. They feel so soft, they're duh, reusable. And I believe they're mink. Yeah, they are. Two of these from ColourPop. These I had to open. But I did not swatch them or try them on yet. The two lippies that I got are Limbo and Stingray. Cause you know how to support my girl. Shout out to it's my Ray Ray. I'm gonna swatch the Stingray first. So like I've been obsessing over it even before she like I like before she posted all those people on her page with different skin tones and like how it looked on them. Flawless, this is it. And I love pink. Like, I probably have more pink lipsticks than anything, but this is like a uh, mix between pink and purple. My two favorites. Like, hello, why would I not get this? <laughs> Next lipstick is Limbo, because I like, I don't have any browns actually, and I, I like a nude, neutral look sometimes. And some are saying that it's comparable to Kylie's lip line called like True Brown or something like that. Who knows, but I cannot wait to create looks with these. And they're mattes. Say no more. These from Too Faced. I did a smaller version though. <laughs> and so I got four of them. It came all together. I believe it was online and whatnot. But these are the colors. I don't feel like I need to swatch them because the swatches of these are everywhere. But I will be creating looks with these too. Um, it came in like a little set, like I said. I think it was like 20 or 25. I was like, on that, on that, okay? So the colors is Malted Berry, Malted Chihuahua, and then there's two metallic, Peony and Macaron. This elf bronzer and blush this is very popular i heard so many people talk about it drugstore why not try it i don't like when i do my makeup i don't contour because i've been afraid to do it i don't know except this look i did a little bit of it but i want to try it with this definitely i also got this because once again a lot of people have been saying this is a really good product to highlight with um drugstore brand why not 
However, right after I got this, why did I find a beauty supply store with LA Girl Concealer? Yeah, LA Girl Concealer. Long story short, I was gonna put a hold on the LA Girl Concealer because it was online. So I bought this. A couple days later, I found this at the beauty supply store. I was like, bruh. <laughs> yes. Thank you, Jesus. Okay, because this is what everyone rants about more versus this. Yeah, I do want to try this and let y'all know how it works out, but no, that's going back to the store, okay? So, I bought a couple different shades in this because I don't like, sometimes I want to chill highlight, sometimes I want to look poppin'. And I got a mascara because all the ones I have ran out while my hair frizzing up. I don't know. But yeah, it's to lengthen and defines. I don't really like mascaras that thicken your, your eyelashes because I feel like I have really thick, curly, annoying eyelashes. So I just want them to lengthen out. And I feel like when they have that type of spoolie, you can do your bottom lash. Glitter, don't know why, but I mean... I'll need it one day, right? So I hard candy. Actually, got a got an eyeliner, whites, cause I never tried chapstick. Everyone's been talking about this rosebud salve. To these, because the real beauty blender is way too much. Mm -mm. Sorry, honey boo boo. I like a bargain. This works. Tried it. Love it. Got it again. Okay, then I have. I I love real techniques. Okay, they're like amazing. Hands down. Um, I got a hand technique. What is this? The uh, powder brush. Also got a contour sculpting brush. About to be on my game. Hey, I can't wait for y'all to see my makeup game elevates. Okay. Also got a NYX matte finish spray. Cause as of right now, when I finish with my makeup, I just use um, not NYX. Elf mist spray. That's not bad. I have no complaints, but I just want to see the difference. So I got this and I heard it was good. Sample. Yeah, that was it from the spa. Dry Cosmetics. Another Instagram name brand if you haven't heard of it. Um, opened it up. Obsessed with this packaging. It's so pretty and pink. But this is a lip gloss, not a lipstick. And it is called Plum Crazy. Yeah, Plum Crazy. Um, it's gold, it has a little blurry ass smear on the back. I wish it lit up though, that'd be fresh. Yeah, I guess it wouldn't be fresh. <laughs> okay. Bruh. was weird but I'm gonna swatch this oh look at that that dried so pretty but I'm gonna swatch this for you guys and for myself see how it comes out the texture is very very sticky and it's extremely pigmented for a lip gloss it's right there on the bottom for some reason I expected it to be a different shape but I can rock with it. Yeah, it's Sora. This is like a subscription box. I don't know if you guys have heard of it or if you guys do it. It's called Play by Sephora. And for this month, they sent me um, perfume, a lippy. Look what color it is. Okay. I love pink, send me, send me, send me. I'm about to swatch this for you guys. And this is a uh, lip cream. So, yes. Okay. <laughs> um, I don't know how I feel about that. It's like extremely sticky. It doesn't even feel like a cream. It feels like 
and I don't, I don't know, I don't know. I'll give it one try and let you guys know, but like I just hate how it just came out. I don't, I don't even want to be disturbing to you guys, but it look like sperm. On to the next, I got another one from Bite. This is a great, great brand, by the way. They are, um, I believe, vegan. Wow, I'm an idiot. No. <laughs> vegan. They are made with natural food grade and organic ingredients. That's what I meant to say because a lot of the products that we put on our lips, aka that rosebud salve, is made out of petroleum. That's something you, like if you're gonna eventually digest what's on your lips, whether it's a little bit or a lot, you, you're, it's gonna happen, right? So, petroleum jelly is not something you really want to digest. I went to school for Cosmo, and like they stressed about how there are like things that aren't good for you when and it comes in makeup so i respect this brand a lot and this color is giving me life already omg but it's just a lip pencil but that works i love it is that her that? Ooh, i can totally match those it, even with the ray ray you love how I just made up that name, Ray Ray? <laughs> it's Stingray. Now this is popping. They also sent a base hydrant, AKA primer, I'm assuming. Yeah, primer. And uh, Argan Oil from Jose Maron. Hope you guys enjoyed that. I can make another separate video if you guys want to know more about the Sephora subscription box. I don't know if everyone got the emails about it, but it's really cool. This is like my second or third month, and it always comes with small samples. Love it. Love it. That was everything. And I can do a review here and there as I make more videos so you guys know what to get, what not to get. Okay, so thank you for watching. <laughs> Okay, let me stop, but I just wanted to focus on this makeup look that I did today. It is something new, okay? Because, first of all, I don't have black eyeliner. I mean, I have black shadow, but I outlined um, my brim with brown pencil. I don't feel like you can see it, though. Whatever. Second, I contoured for my first time, okay? And not my first time, but the first time that I actually... Did it and I liked it and it looks really like subtle which is how I like it and third of all I don't have a winged liner dude <laughs> no but really I'm loving this look so if you're feeling this look as much as I am let me know I'll do a, um yeah that's nice when you just leave all this on your hand and then you okay thing if you guys are feeling this look as much as I am let me know like comment subscribe I will be doing a tutorial if you guys are feeling that because I feel like you guys just don't feel my makeup videos that much so yeah stick around don't forget to subscribe I will be back next week to see you guys thank you anyway stick around I'll be again uh, that moment when your camera's a hater and just stops recording because it's out of space. Make space. So.